Why do you think that you're the more conservative candidate? Why do you think that you're more electable? I think those are two very different questions. I, I think I'm clearly the more conservative candidate by any rational standard. I, mean, I had a 90 percent American conservative union standing for 20 years. I helped Ronald Reagan and Jack Kemp develop supply side economics. I helped lead the effort to defeat communism in the Congress. I helped, uh, as Speaker of the House, balance the federal budget for four straight years, reform welfare as an entitlement, the first tax cut since 16 years. I mean, take whatever your list of conservatism is, there are places in my career where I've done that stuff. Um, and I've been consistent about it. I mean, I was for Ronald Reagan long before people began just to quote him. Um, so that part, I think there's no, no contest. Uh, the electability thing is a question of how you think the environment, how you think elections work. I think in the Reagan tradition, in the tradition of 1994 and the contract, if you get a real contrast in a country which is more than two to one conservative, the liberal loses. But you have to have the courage to fight your way through the New York Times and through CBS News and through MSNBC and, and be steady in drawing the contrast. So I think the person who is able to debate Obama and draw a sharp and defined contrast has an enormous advantage. Uh, I don't think you go to the middle, you bring the middle to you. you for example, American energy is a 79% issue. Now, the New York Times thinks the middle is between 79 and the 16% who aren't for it. I think the middle is 50%. That means you get 50% plus 29. 